Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to show you how to make a DIY lava lamp. So, you will need vegetable oil and vinegar, and an empty bottle. Make sure it's blown out fully. Um, so, yeah. Um, just dump a lot of vegetable oil in. Sorry about the background noises if you hear people talking. Dump a good amount in. So the camera is moving a lot. Um, there's a lot of background noises, so I'm trying to move forward. And we're continuing. I'm putting that much in to our empty bottle. And now it's time. Anyway, um, she, she knows that I have a YouTube channel. <sighs> so the vinegar just kind of ex exploded. Hold on. So, Jeff needs in the car. Hold on, guys. Stop talking. But Oh my goodness. So this looks a little bit more. Just for fun. It, it should look like that. Um So you see that kind of I'm gonna change the color of them. Just plain and plain's not good. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go upstairs and find my food coloring. Oh my gosh. I forget where I put my food coloring. Great, just great. I don't even have food coloring. Who don't have food coloring? I feel like everyone has food coloring except me. I never have food coloring. I talk a lot. Um, okay. I think I might just use this blue marker. Comment down below if your favorite color it is blue. Sorry. So I'm gonna see if this works because other than that, oh my gosh, my neck hurts. Um, other than that, I have nothing. Nothing happened. See, it still works fine. Okay, wait a second. I'm gonna try to find a tool that will like pinch it to make it come out. Um, I have literally like barely anything in my house. It's not that I just moved here, it's, it's because I'm being sarcastic. I'm trying to pull this little thing out. Oh my gosh, these things don't work. I don't really want to. Oh. Oh. Let me see something. I'm going to see if my pack has been smooth in his tool. 
whole bucket that I can use. Good. I don't know what these are. Oh my gosh. Looks good enough. So. I got the piece out. So. Yeah. That's what that piece looks like. So you just want to pull, pull the back and the front off and then you'll get to the part that you actually need, which is this part. Um, now I have an empty Crayola thing. I have you've never seen inside of the marker. Um, I'm going to try to get a few drops in here. Um, this is washable so I hope it really won't do a lot. Oh my gosh, that just dripped on my leg, and I don't know if this stains, but it it stays pretty good. You want to see? That's what just stained. A little drip made that big drip. Um, um being a little tiny scientist, I guess. So, yeah. Mm. Here we go. Let's shake it up. Shake it up. And see what happens. So, not really half, not much is happening. Um, now it's like a light blue, but I kind of want it darker in some places, so. So I added a few drops, as you see, and it is inside the bottle. Um, I want to know if you could zoom in. Okay, so you can kind of see some little parts moving. I'll get out of the frame in the back. If you look really closely, 
some of it is moving. Oh my goodness. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Bye.